Well, hello there, YouTube. Welcome to the 3rd of October. At a crazy early in the morning. Before we fumigate ourselves out in here, let's roll this truck out and go drive into the darkness to Portland and head to, uh, let's head to Texas this morning. Yep. Come on along. <laughs> it's 51 degrees, slight rain. And if there was ever a chance I was gonna miss a flight, it'll be today. We're over 50 minutes late. Rolling into PDX. I'm supposed to be here 46 minutes ago. So my flight literally takes off in an hour and uh, 14 minutes. Hope I don't have a problem with TSA. This bag is not light. No. Holy moly. I'll probably get charged extra for checking this thing in. We're yeah. at the Sky Bridge at PDX. Look at that nightmare. Wee! It's like a carnival ride that's riding around you. Well, there, little woman, this is where we say our goodbyes. I'll see you in six days. Alright, we see you bye. Alright. Yeah. <laughs> Alright. Alright. Bye bye now. Love you. See you bye. I uh, tried to take a shot of getting on the plane, but the camera app kept crashing on me, so I apologize. I'm on, and now everything's working. I am in the good old state of Texas. My, uh, my ride should be out here somewhere. I said he have his lights on. I'll be looking for him. Welcome to Texas. Texas, man. So this is the, what's the name of the Harley shop again? Maverick, Harley Davidson, just outside of Dallas, little outskirts there, I guess you call it Dallas. But this is gonna be the ride for the next six days. Heck yeah. Bag fit on there perfectly. It's all nice and tight like the other rides. It's time to go to Paris now. Y'all come on for the ride. It's like 94 or something out there, you said? It's hot. <laughs> we'll be all right. All right, boys and girls. Let's, uh, let's head to Paris, Texas on a road king. Yeah, buddy. Wow, these bars are a whole lot taller than uh, my uh, old road king. Oh, no, it's got the heel toe shifter on it. And I forgot to put my glasses on. Yeah, hot. He's seriously hot. I think he, it was 94 at one point, and uh, I don't. And I don't know what that would equal with the heat index out. Heat index out here. We can barely see the turn signals on this thing. Way I'm out in the bright sun, looking against a shiny dash. I didn't strap my helmet. Getting all in a hurry here. All right, let me get uh, let me get sorted here. Welcome to Texas, and I do mean actually Texas. Got you in Dallas at the moment. We're gonna head northeast, I think, pretty much. Yeah, northeast. So uh, I'll be chit chatting with you as we go along here. Man, did I mention that it's hot yet? That's a shocker to the old system right there. Man, look at this. These crazy bridges all over the place out here. It's kind of hazy. I could see it from the uh, jet when we were, uh, we were coming along. That was pretty cool. So the plane it gets to a point where it, it does a hard left. I was on the left side of the plane. There's a hard left and uh, we're really low. We're sweeping in. I look down, what do I see? A Whataburger. <laughs> I, think, I think that might be a Texas only thing or something. 
we got some crazy bridges down here. Holy moly. Man, down around this Dallas area, it is flat as a flitter. I already knew that. So I stopped here. It's called a race racetrack for a couple of things. One, my phone's in dark mode. That's driving me nuts. I did that on the plane. I have it in auto so that it, based on sunrise, sunset, it changes. I'm going to grab me a little snack bar here right quick because I'm starving. And uh, switch, try to change this mount so I can see this thing a little better. Holy moly, it's hot out here. What does my watch say? It is? Oh, it's still in nav mode. Anyway, I'll be right back with y'all. So I'm in a little town called Melissa, Texas. 93 degrees out here right now but uh, looks like it's gonna be a little cooler over the next few days which would be nice look at this one dollar a gallon less for super than we pay for regular in in a Toledo it's a three it's oh no I'm sorry it's 329.9 for regular it dropped down. It was 369 for a while. Look at that, 269. Put three gallons in it for eight dollars and thirty cents. And uh, <laughs> take off the things. Less than a half a tank of gas. Yeah, it was just just a scotch under the halfway mark. Dang. <laughs> and they'll probably charge me if I return this thing. Oh. If I return this thing with no gas in it, right? Look at that. Texas, baby. My home state. I wasn't born here, but I consider it my home state. Spent a lot of years here in Texas. Love it, love it, love it. Doesn't have that stark raving beauty of the Pacific Northwest. But, uh, yeah, Texas. Texas proud. It's like a whole nother country. back roads of Texas, man. Looks like that could possibly be some rain up there or it's just looking so deep into the haze. I love it. Road signs, all the Texas highway, whatever on there. It's like, man, take me back. Flash back to the good old days. Although this area it's like no pine trees love the pine trees because the heat's not bothering me at all man i stepped out of that airport uh wait for my ride and that was that was uh humbling to say the least it was like wow holy moly and i'm standing there with all my gear on my travel gear and uh man I, I was walking a bit trying to figure out where he was and uh anyway we texted and ended up calling each other but uh man i thought uh, i thought man this is gonna be too much and then i don't know it just like summer just snapped right back into me again it's like ah, well, whatever it hasn't bothered me since don't get me wrong, it's hot. <laughs> Need to get my little meter out and see what the uh, heat index is. But the humidity doesn't seem to be that bad. Yeah, but I'm fine. Got my old BRP, little slippy, wicky, whatever you want to call it thing on, and just happy as you please. Cruising along on a very, very comfortable Road King. Man, <laughs> Road King with a Milwaukee 8. It just you hit big old bumps it's because it's got just the regular suspension you know nothing squatted you just go <laughs> it's got full touring suspension on it absolutely wonderful i don't know man that's starting to look a little more threatening the farther i go here <laughs> i did bring rain gear but man i just can't imagine putting some rain gear on in this heat I think it'd be better just to get wet 
and uh, let your clothes be uh, one of those uh, cool suits, you know. So this is probably not too good because uh, now I smell the rain. One thing about the south, you definitely smell it when it's coming. <laughs> and usually you're in a flat enough area, you see it when it's coming. I just hope that somehow or another I'm going to skirt past that because I can see the rain coming down now. And it don't just sprinkle around here. It's still just absolutely flat as a flitter out here. I mean, some rolling hills here and, here and there, but it's a lot rollier hills here than what it was down around Dallas. Man, they synchronize uh, levels down there. Man, that is not looking pretty. <laughs> oh no. This guy here has been, uh, he come flying around a car that was behind, or a pickup truck. They got between me and like three times he's tried to pass this pickup truck and almost went head on with cars. Death wish this boy dives out I'm uh, gonna be ready to hit the brakes because I don't want to want any collateral damage when pieces of his motorcycle comes flying back <laughs> that's pretty crazy there ain't no reason to be in that kind of hurry I'm telling you what if I don't get wet it's gonna be a miracle I'm really close 0.8 of a mile I'm close. I, I think I'm. Oh, <laughs> there's Paris Harley Davidson right there. Look at the gathering there. So there's a few people here. There she is, Paris Harley Dog Davidson. Man, with that them rain clouds, the humidity must be somewhere around about two thousand <laughs> percent. So I'm all checked in. So, <laughs> using my Apple card for this thing, and it won't go, won't go. She goes, does the chip work? I said, yeah, I've been using it all day, you know. It's easier just to keep everything on one card. That way, you, you, there's your trip, you know. Well, uh, <laughs> like a meathead, because there's no numbers on it, you know. I didn't realize that I was putting it in with the chip down the chip needed to be up in the reader and the poor gal is just free she's like stressing out I don't understand why it won't work then it pulls up a thing says enter card number I said well that's real tricky anyway let me get to my place here <clears throat> here's my humble abode for the next five nights that's all they had was a a double queen, which is fine. Nice little area here. Ooh, got a nice little closet. A little simple, clean bathroom. Got a coffee maker in there. Look at that. That's pretty cool. This is like them little places in Ontario I stay at. Air, condi air conditioner works good. That's always a major bonus. Very nice. We're here, we made it. Paris, Texas. Ooh, look at this sunset. That rainstorm kind of just blew off. It actually said it was raining out here at one point, but I never seen it rain at all. She's done moved on to wherever. <laughs> I took about an hour's nap. I laid down there for a second, and bam, it was lights out. Anyway, just kind of looking around, see if there's something cool within walking distance. There's a Denny's down here, but it's on the other side of the freeway. I haven't eaten at a Denny's in I don't even know how long. So I seen this Brahm hamburger, like a hamburger at a little grocery store. They call it Fresh Market. This thing is straight out of the 60s. It is so old school. Oh man, I was having a crazy flashback. Man, look at that. Ooh, doggy, that's pretty. It's so awesome. Everything is so old school. 
There's no crosswalk. There's no crosswalk signs. There's no sidewalks. People are walking around. You just do it like a smart human being. Pay attention to your dang self. Reminds me when I was a kid. There were no crosswalk signs. That was for the that was for the big cities. You just learn to uh, look both ways before you cross the street. It'll be a knucklehead. Oh, I heard an echo from that truck going underneath. I go, man, that sounds like a train. Wow. Small town Texas, man. It's so cool. I think I'm just on the outskirts of, of Paris. You gotta go, go deeper to see more. But uh, Paris Harley Davis is just right down the street there. Yeah, good old fashioned Texas red clay, man. That stuff would not clean off your knobbies. You go out there riding your little mini bike and get yourself stuck. <laughs> your car or anything. Well, hello there, YouTube. <laughs> Just sitting out here at the end of the day, reflecting on the day. It was uh, it was awesome. The flight was good. All the stress that I worried about, nothing. The ride was good. The heat didn't bother me. It was a good day. The old Road King man, she's a trooper. I think it's actually nice. The seat seems like it has a little less padding than my uh, than my street light. I think it might be one of those. Uh, um, short reach seats or whatever they're called but um, I was fine I started at about an hour and a half mark started fidgeting around a little bit but uh, it could have been just the heat you know just the, the whole day's been going 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 but um, anyway I'm busting down on the video here try because I got to get yesterday and today's done so uh, Kelly sent a quick little thing here for us Thank you so much for watching. We really do appreciate it. We will talk to you tomorrow. Same smoke time, same smoke channel. Don't forget to give her a thumbs up and you guys have a wonderful Friday or Saturday. Take care. Anyway, isn't that sweet, that little woman? But on that, I'm going to bust out some videos. I get up tomorrow, head for Texarkana and uh, meet up with uh, John Maxwell and whoever else is there and ride in back here to Paris. So. It'll be a uh, uh, probably be three four hour ride alone, and then plus hanging out. So. Anyway, thank you guys for coming along. Welcome to Texas. Hot day. All right, we'll see you guys tomorrow.